Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome to the Assassin's Creed, the first game on PC playthrough. I am going to do this because I've been watching gameplay footage of Assassin's Creed Black Flag, and I was like, you know what? I really want 60 bucks right now, but I can't find a way of doing it except for just waiting for a paycheck to go through from broadband TV, or just uh, save up money for my next paycheck and then go get it and play it on my Xbox, which. I don't know if it'd run on my PC, that'd be interesting to see, but I want to do this playthrough because I'm doing uh, Spore right now, and I said that I was doing Spore first because that's the first one I found, and I, I, it took me forever to finally find this game in my bedroom, it was, I thought it was on my bookshelf, so I was going, you know, just all out just trying to find this fucking game, only to find out it was under, like, a whole bunch of fucking papers and shit on top of a pillow that's on top of a box laying on my carpet sitting not laying that was kind of weird just sitting on my box <laughs> sitting on the carpet so I was like oh my god I gotta do playthrough now <laughs> so Assassin's Creed I love this game to death played it so much I'm gonna play it for you guys give you my opinions about this game this game is one of my favorites. I love the first one. The ones after that, this one, I don't know. This one's my favorite, and I'm going to love Black Flag when I finally get it. Get away from me, hoes! I applied my heart to no wisdom, and to no madness and folly. I perceived that this also was a chasing of the wind. For in much wisdom, he is much grief. You've got a problem. I can't anchor him to the memory. Too much psychological trauma. He's rejecting the treatment, retreating. Desmond, I need you to try and relax. God damn it! I'm not fucking I clicking on the window. Oh my god! Listen to the sound of my voice. Recognize that what you're seeing isn't real. Fuck you, Just a bitch. Of the past. I can't hurt you. Damn it. It's not working. Give it a moment, Mr. He'll adjust. The first time oh he's never god. Easy. Fucking Christ. I hope that gets fixed. That's enough, Mr. Stillman. We need to pull him out. Can I use my now. controller? I All wish right. I could. We're going to try and bring you out. Would you fucking bring me out already? Holy shit! That never took that long before. Oh my god, this fucking game. Okay? <gasps> I told you he'd be fine. Bastards! Now, now, I just saved your life. Saved my life? You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing! Animus. It's an animus. I don't even know you people! Why are you doing this to me? You have information we need, Mr. Miles. Information? I'm a bartender, for Christ's sakes! What do you want me to do, teach you how to mix a martini? We know who you are. What you are. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. And whether you realize it or not, you've got something that my employers want. Locked away in that head of yours. But I'm not an assassin. Not anymore. Yes, your file indicated as much. Something about an escape. Most fortunate for us. What do you want from me? For you to do as you're told. The Animus will allow us to locate what we need. Once we have it, you'll be free to go. I am not going back in there. Then we'll induce a coma and continue our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Just kick his ass. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. You're insane. So what is it, Mr. Miles? Live or die? Kill him. Lie down. Fuck you, I'm not lying down. I always hate it when they come back to real life. I just want to stay in the game. Down, 
Oh, fuck you, whore. Kick your ass later. A wise decision. Okay, so if I go too far to the right, my mouse goes off the game. And onto the screen, which I don't even know if you can send my mouse cursor, but that's gonna be fucking annoying as hell. Inside the animus, which is... It's a projector that renders genetic memories in three dimensions. Genetic memory. Seems you'll need a bit of a tutorial. Very well. We'll start simple. What is a memory, Mr. Miles? It's the recollection of a past event. Specific to the individual remembering the event. Yeah, sure. What if I told you that the human body not only housed an individual's memory, up, but the memories of his ancestors as well? Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. How do animals know when and where to go? What to do? That's just animal instinct. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. Whatever you call it, the fact remains. These creatures hold knowledge absent the requisite first-hand experience. I've spent the past 30 years trying to understand why. I discovered something most you just shut the fuck up when we play? Our DNA functions as an archive. It contains not only Old genetic fuck. instructions passed down from previous generations, but memories as well. The memories of our ancestors. I don't want to look at your ugly and the face. I don't want to look decode and read these DNA files. Sticking your nose. But there's a problem. This is the specific memory we're trying to access. No, I... Unfortunately, when we try and open the memory, your mind withdraws. You Good. lack the confidence to step into your ancestor's body. That's what happened earlier. You got knocked out of the target memory and pushed back to a more stable state. Why? It's your subconscious. It's resisting. We found similar reactions among patients who undergo hypnosis to relive traumatic events. They can't jump directly into the specific memory. They need to be eased in. Even then, there can be problems. So how do we fix it? We find a memory you can synchronize with, and we move forward from there. You'll get used to it. This is the closest we can get, so it's where we'll have to start. I'm uploading the tutorial program now. Yep, this is going to be the most interesting playthrough I've ever done. I'll tell you in just a second. Data stream unstable. Attempting to restore synchronization. <sighs> Shut up. Hello, Subject 17. This tutorial I am not number 17. Fuck you. acclimate you to the Animus's control system. Instructions ah. will oh follow God. shortly. This is going to be so weird. The synchronization bar represents how in sync you are with your ancestors' memories. If you ever fall completely out of sync, the Animus will restore you to your last synchronized position. You are currently dangerously close to desynchronization. Please follow all forthcoming instructions in order to restore system Fuck. stability. The Animus utilizes a puppeteering concept to control the actions of your ancestor. I'm loading subroutines to validate your body's adaptation to the Animus. We will begin by exploring the default actions of each input. While standing still, use the head button to observe your environment. Good. Use your empty hand to walk through these jar carriers without causing them to drop what they're holding. Proceed to the marker to continue the synchronization process. I'm trying. Whoops. It's not fucking working. Well done. Yeah, well done indeed. The animus differentiates between two fundamental actions. Low profile and high profile. Low-profile actions are socially acceptable. High-profile actions are more action-oriented. Hold the high-profile button to see how your heads-up display changes the context of the puppeteering inputs. Excellent. We 
will continue your synchronization process by testing some high profile actions. Grab and throw this individual onto the mark. But one and shift hand button in high profile. Oh, whoops. Good. I also want to try something when we're done here. Using your leg button in high profile will allow you to sprint. Sprinting is useful to escape from soldiers or to get closer to a fleeing target. However, be careful not to bump into anyone, for you can lose your balance and tumble to the ground. And tumble While to the ground. Reach the marker before this man does. I'll try. Well done. Which is like barely faster too. The Animus will also provide other important information. The social status icon gives you information on your social status. The different states will be displayed in context soon. This icon appears when a soldier is looking at you. The yellow color means the soldier is either unaware or suspicious of who you are. To illustrate the change in awareness level, you will stealth assassinate this soldier. First, lock onto your target. Now, select your hidden blade. With your blade selected, walk up to the soldier and assassinate him by using your armed hand button. Responsible for this. Right over here. Hello. The dead body has alerted the soldier and changed his awareness to informed as represented by the red witness indicator. Aggressive actions or socially unacceptable behavior undertaken at this time. Unacceptable behavior. An armed response. Provoke this soldier. All right, come here. Stop, bitch! Notice how the social status icon has changed to exposed. Use the ladder and try to break the line of sight. All right, hold on. Ow! Oh, you missed. I'll get you. Excellent. The line of sight has been broken. Now run into the roof garden to hide from the soldier. <laughs> oh shit! Good. Your social status indicates that you are hidden. But the yeah, so easy to see me too. Wait until your social status changes again. Oh man, where'd he go? This is Fuck that. I can't leave. I tried. Well done. The soldier has lost your track. You are now anonymous, and you can exit the hide spot. I got away with murder. Awesome. Do that any day. Excellent. Oh, shut up. Let me play. Being anonymous will fill your synchronization bar and make your job as an assassin easier. There are different places which you can use to hide. However, you must always break the line of sight first, and then use a hide spot to vanish. Alright. I was gonna say, wasn't there one more? I wanna go with the two girls on the bench. Oh, come on! Let us continue with a demonstration of Blend. Blend can be activated <laughs> with the passive use of your legs. You can mimic a scholar and pass near soldiers without arousing suspicion. Use this to reach the marker behind the soldiers. Yeah, whatever. Unsuspicioso, right here, bitch. Hmm. <sighs> you smell so good. Oh shit! Ah, oh, wasn't it turning on to you? I'm sorry. Oh god. Good. you are fully synced a new ability is available fuck to those you. templars referred to as ego vision this sixth sense helped your ancestor understand the intentions of people around him well done all right 
yellow assassination, red a soldier, and the other two I can remember. Remember, <laughs> vision will only be available once you are fully synced. Oh Please shut up. Note that following the Assassin's Creed, <gasps> Let me play way of life will assist you with staying in sync. I wanna kill some Creed civilians. No. <laughs> First, never hurt an innocent person. Fuck you. Second, always be discreet. Fuck you. Third, do not compromise the clan. Should Too late. You, lose sync, you can restore synchronization by reliving key moments of your ancestors' life, or by respecting the creed. How about fucking with the creed, you huh? Have successfully completed the tutorial. The most stable memory block will now be loaded. You are pretty face. I try to cosplay as this guy every day I worried from work and to work. I just put on my white hoodie, cover half my face, and Wait, then just call it good. There must be another way. This one need not die. An excellent kill. Fortune favors your blade. Not fortune, skill. Watch a while longer and you might learn something. Indeed. He'll teach you how to disregard everything the Master's taught us. And how would you have done it? I would not have drawn attention to us. I would not have taken the life of an innocent. What I would have done is follow the creed. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Understand these words. It matters not how we complete our task. Only that it's done. But this is not the way of- My way is better. I will scout ahead. Try not to dishonor us further. What is our mission? My brother would say nothing to me. Only that I should be honored to have been invited. The Master believes the Templars have found something beneath the Temple Mount. Treasure? I do not know. All that matters is the Master considers it important. Else he would not have asked me to retrieve it. Alright. I will be back in just like one second. <laughs>